Hi everyone. I look for a lot of the different secrets and mysteries from all around the world, looking for the coming of our Lord and Savior, Jesus Christ, Emmanuel, the Son of God, who was raised from the dead and took all the sins of the world away. Now the world elite, the Illuminati, the Freemasons, and even the spiritual realms that are all around us, they leave their signs and secrets right in front of us. And on our channel, we bring all of this back to the Word of God and show how we're nearing the end of days. Well, today is September 2nd, and ISIS, this militant group in the Middle East, has beheaded this other journalist, just as they had done to the other journalist named Foley. In the other one, we had shown how the person that actually did the beheadings, the cloaked Islamic figure, actually had a British accent, and that a lot of this group is it's being prepared by the the British Empire and the the royal family will be doing a big part of in the Bible what's known as the great deception coming and a part of the harvest on the earth even with this Islam group and with many other countries with Russia and China and North Korea and Islam it's a great deception coming and all of the world gives its power to this beast well today is September 2nd and this is also exactly 40 days since the time that ISIS destroyed this tomb over here in Iraq when they destroyed Jonah's tomb and in the Bible it talks of Jesus talks of the sign of Jonah and that represented him being in in the earth for three days and then being resurrected and it also means something at the end of times here now here we have we know that the world elite are running this darn ISIS thing I mean this is all run by the British Empire and the CIA and even Russia and all of this beast system that's coming for the mark of the beast. Now the Islamic people involved are just puppets. The whole thing, it's all just puppets to go against Jesus Christ. But in the Bible it talks of 40 days that Jonah was talking of before Nineveh would be basically destroyed. And now exactly 40 days from when, this, when ISIS blew up this tomb, they have beheaded this man right here as another sign to the USA and a warning. Well, ISIS is all around us. See here, ISIS pharmaceuticals even. Katy Perry, almost every other video, she plays an ISIS character. And it's, this is shown all over the place. Nicki Minaj plays this character. Madonna does. I mean, just on and on. Lady Gaga plays this mother ISIS figure all the time. And you can see right here, we have this connection going on with, with Britain again, with basically the Queen of Hearts here in the old Alice legend. Well, today also was the end of 40 days, and on September 1st was also the end of the Burning Man Festival, where they actually burn an effigy of a man just as witchcraft, just like the Celtics things that were done. And over here, a woman actually died a few days ago at this event, and her name was Alicia, just like Alice, just again like we had Alice in Wonderland and the Queen and Britain ready to rise up. In the Bible, a red side rises up against, basically, the blue. The blue side represents the Jacob, just as in the Old Testament, Jesus Christ talks of putting, all of, putting a cord of blue in all of Israel's garments. But the red represents the, the group called Edom, and known as the butchers, basically. And this side rises up for a time, and it's the time of Jacob's trouble. In other words, they're actually going to be blessed to do all these terrible things that are coming and do this great deception for the time that it's coming all upon the earth. So this group is actually being run by the British royalty, preparing for Prince William and the end of days, all coming. How else can we prove this? Well, I map out all of the world and show how the whole earth is as a grid. Right here is Buckingham Palace. You see ISIS everywhere? Isis, 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 and for those who doesn't, don't know it, it is also a type of part of the Isis and the beast from the bottomless pit. Just as right here with Stephen King. See right here? This it, this clown figure trying to trick everybody. Right there, Isis. Right here is Buckingham Palace. See right here? Buckingham Palace. And in the Bible, it talks of this beast, just like this, this dragon. 
See the dragon right there, perfect. And you can see Prince William right in the middle here, preparing for the end of days. He will be doing part of the Great Tribulation. Over here is actually the ISIS figure exactly as in Katy Perry's video. In Katy Perry's video, she has, she's on like an ark and has this big idol behind her because the Bible talks of this idol worship coming. See her back here? She has this giant idol behind her, right here. Here she is, right here, doing this great deception that's coming upon the earth. Here she is, right here. See this? With the big idol exactly as we showed before. And Russia's all involved with this too. Russia's right here as these bears. And they've already been taken over by this new type of Eucharist that's coming. Just like the Russian Orthodox Church is already all prepared. She has control of all of that. This is the Mother Mary worship and all of the idol worship. Just as doing the beads. But right there is that. There's Prince William and this is known as the Little Horn of the Bible. There's Isis right there. And just as with Isis Pharmaceuticals. See Isis Pharmaceuticals preparing to make the fake the fake cure for the disease that is released all upon the world. Right here. Right there in front of us. Over and over and over again all day long. May God have mercy on us all. They have this video game that just came out also called Wolfenstein. The New Order. And it shows the Nazis rising up. And right here, it actually shows this man getting the mark of the beast. A tattoo on his right arm. Right there. And you can see four Isis. I-S-I-S. -I -S, as a 1515. A five is seen as an S. Just like an S. Four Isis. There they are. Doing the mark of the beast. With Isis. Here they are right here in England at Buckingham Palace showing them as the beast rising up and doing the all of it doing the end times the mark of the beast right here right in front of you right there there it is these are the ones that are actually cutting the people's heads off the these are the ones that actually killed this man an American that's what they're showing that the red side the red coats the Russia North Korea China everybody is ready to rise up and betray the USA and burn us with fire it's even shown right inside of many different of the um, Denver Airport murals let's show it right here for those that haven't seen these things before here it is right here the Bible says ten nations are going to come together and betray the USA This mural hangs in the Denver International Airport. It shows these ten horns as the ten nations betraying the USA and burning us all with fire. And you can see right over here this whale represents all of us getting our oil and even being probably in the belly of the whale for three days for ascension. And then on this side it shows the beheadings coming. See how this buffalo has lost its head right here? All of this is coming. May God have mercy on us all. There you go. Confess with your mouth the Lord is Jesus. Believe in your heart God hath risen him from the dead and you'll be saved. Hallelujah. Right in front of us all day long. May God have mercy on everybody in this poor pe person's family that's involved. America is under attack by all of the world and Satan. This is Mecca where they go around the black box, the Kaaba, all of Islam over here. See this box cover for the Illuminati card game? And with this clown up here running everything, right here, making a joke out of everything on the earth? This represents the rapture situation and when the USA falls, when this eagle leaves, you can see the dead rising and then the idol worship, just as we showed in England right there with the big idol and then this new type of cure that's actually a false hope and part of the mark of the beast coming to do this all. See this guy right here? 
this guy is running all of Islam. Islam is not real. Jesus Christ is the only way. Jesus Christ is the Son of God raised from the dead. So Allah cannot be God. Allah has to be the beast from the bottomless pit. This clown right here. This is right where they go around the idol. All of Islam does not even call this an idol, but they bow to it, they pray to it, and they do it five times per day, mimicking the fifth age coming. See the five up there? And the age of judgment. There he is, right there. Perfect. Right there, known as the little horn of the Bible. Right here. May God have mercy on us all. Hallelujah. Jesus Christ is the only way. And Jehovah is God. And he has a son. His son is Jesus Christ, whom he raised from the dead. Hallelujah.